<laughs> okay, so we're still in the main. Well, I don't know in the main, but we're in that large chamber with all this with all the skeletons. You've just dispatched the final one. I gotta put this away. It's gonna be noisy. I'm not editing that. I'm leaving this in. <laughs> I gotta put my dice that so I'm not the world using away. Know what I deal with. <laughs> if I wah, did wah. that over you, oh the shit I would have received. <laughs> you came down through the elevator shaft, and uh, the only other exit you see out of this chamber door on the other end of the chamber. That's the only other way out that you've that you've been able to notice. It looks like a makeshift. Sort of like they built it themselves, like the planks that hold the door, uh, that, that make up the door are a little off-center. Mm-hmm. They don't quite sit perfectly. You want me to go up to the door? Are we inspecting the door? I was going to inspect the door. I'll inspect the door. I can use my mage hand to inspect the door. <gasps> okay. You're uh, doing what? I'm going to use my mage hand. Okay. Um, so I'll get within 30 feet of the door, and I'm going to just basically pat around with the, the floating hand to see if I... Um, I don't know, trigger a trap or you know, okay. something like that. As you pat with the door, you can see it, it, it sort of does like swing open and then close a little bit. It's poorly made, yeah. um, but it's not triggering any traps. It's not triggering any traps. Yeah. Or, okay. You want me to All stealth right. in? Yeah, I think, I think you're free to go to the door. Okay, I'm going to walk up to the door very quietly, and I'm going to try to peek through the door. You're going to peek through the door? Yeah. Okay. You see a long tunnel, uh, brick walls on both sides. It's just a long brick wall a tunnel. Long tunnel, yep. Um, how far with my dark vision can I see? I, can, I know I can see, I know I can see 60 feet. Where would it go? Whatever. Um, can I see anything at the end of that? Keeps going out past your vision. Okay. Any light sources? Um, no. Any smells? Make a perception check. Okay, that's what I wanted. I wanted to roll. Not one. I can only smell my own pits. When was the last time I showed one? <laughs> Probably Very been months. Nice. Very nice. I'm, Literally I'm a cat rolling a one. That's because, your call. Yeah. Um, I'm going to. You're you're at the door itself. Yeah. For, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm just gonna look back and be like, guys, it's only a long passage. Okay. I want to be behind her because I want to walk up and look because I can see one twenty. Okay. Goes out past your vision. It goes out past my vision. Long hallway. Yep. Um. Do I remember correctly? Do you have a slingshot? Yes, I do. Okay. Um, I, I want to cast light on a rock or marble or whatever you've got. I have rocks. Okay. And I'll sling it down the hall. Yeah, sling it down the hall. All right. I'm going to take my slingshot. I'm going to take one of my rocks. Okay. I cast light. Cast light on the rock. Mm-hmm. And... Oh. And it appears to have, like, hit yes. some sort of other ball on the end, and then just came to a stop. Okay. But it's like a little pinpoint way past. A little pinpoint way past, as it bounced. As it bounced down. And you can see that it very subtly bounced against something, and then dropped. Okay. Oh. It's like a dead end? No, it goes down, I think. Do you see how it went down? So we can't see the pinpoint anymore. No, it dropped onto the floor. And you can see the pinpoint of light. It bounced against something, and then dropped onto the floor. Okay. I think it's worth going down there. It turns... I think we should go. Who wants to go? I'm going to go. I'll hold them. All right. I'm going to self ahead. Okay. You want to self check? So just you, just the two of you are going in? Well, I'm saying I'm going to go. I'm going to go, and I'm going to start walking. And Eleanor, you're going in behind him. Yeah. I'll stay in the back. Yeah. I don't want her to go alone. Him. How, how wide? Yeah, I'm sorry. How sorry. wide is the... Yeah, yeah. Uh, about 10 wide. feet. All right, so we're walking two by two. I was going to go ahead of everybody else. Okay, so you go ahead. All right. I guess I'll stay in the group, but I will enter. Okay. Is everybody entering, or are Lorelai, Kara, and Morpheus staying back? We're staying back. You're not going in, okay? Not, You're staying yeah, back? Not yet, yep. Okay. I like to enter. You're entering? Yeah. Okay, so just Lorelai and Morpheus are hanging back. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so the four of you enter. Mm-hmm. The corridor stretches just to the end of... Lilith's dark vision, so it goes about 120 feet. As you enter, it's this weird effect, like you move 60 feet in, but you don't appear to be getting any closer to the end. It appears that even though you can feel yourself moving and you can see that you're progressing forward, the end is not getting any closer. Even with the light there? 
even with the light there, you're not getting any closer mm -hmm. to the light. And I can never see past it. Correct. Okay. And a strange thing, Morpheus and Lorelei, as soon as they step through, you lost sight of them. It's almost mm -hmm. as if they went through and turned invisible. Okay. Okay. Okay, how long does this happen for before I get, like, suspicious? You go 60 feet in, and then you come across two objects laying in the hallway. Okay. Now, the marching order was you were stealthing ahead, Eleanor was a little bit behind you, and then Kara and Lilith were behind. Okay. Kara and Lilith make me perception checks. See, I got 15. Okay. Nine. So, Lilith, you happen to just take a look behind you as you walk through, and you don't see Morpheus and Lorelei. You don't see the door where you came through. It just appears to be... It appears to be a closed door, almost as if they closed the door behind you. Mm -hmm. But looking at the door from this side, it doesn't have that weird, misshapen, hand-put-together effect. It looks like a perfectly nice, nice sealed door that seals right up against the, the hallway. Oh, okay. And it is 60 feet away from you. Okay. I'm going to call um, Kara's attention to that. Um, Kara? Look, turn, turn around and look behind us. Like, yes. We're in some kind of, like... Hall of Illusion. See, that door is like, it's like a door now. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Should we... Do I hear this? I'm yeah. farther up, right? Unless, you're you, un unless you were whispering, you would all hear it. No, I, I, yeah, I'm just talking. I'm not whispering. Yeah. Um, you're standing next to me, but anybody can hear it. Okay. Yeah. You come across, as this is happening behind you, you come across two objects on the ground at the midway point of this tunnel. Okay. What do they look like? Can I investigate them? Sure. 16. 16? Okay. They are two races that you haven't come across yet in Danad. One looks almost fiendish. The skin appears to be red. It's hard to tell because it is a little dark in here. And there is some level of decomposition that has gone on. But it appears that the skin had been once red. You're seeing little horns coming out. Female, very dead. Very and the, the next question. question. And the other object lying opposite her is a humanoid... Like how um, Spot is a humanoid cat or a humanoid tiger, this appears to be a humanoid elephant. Quadrupedal body, but right. definitely the head of an elephant with an elephant's trunk. Uh, also very dead with a long sword impaled through its chest. Okay. Several questions. Okay. One, same level of deep comp? Yes. Same level. With the level, with the, the 16 on the investigation, right? Yeah. Two. Does the red skin thing have wounds inflicted to herself? Yes, there are... Self-inflicted or looks like she was in a battle? There are bruises on her body that match the size, shape, and pattern of the elephant's trunk. And the sword that is impaled into him, could that have been self-inflicted? The tiefling is wearing a sheath that looks like that sword would have fit it perfectly. Okay. And now, no other markings, no other footprints, nothing else. The long sword looks like it was self-inflicted. Like the, the, you know it's a Loxodon. Like the Loxodon used the tiefling sword. Probably. Well, I'm from this city anyway. But you've never seen, you may have seen a tiefling, you've never seen a Loxodon. Okay. Do they look like adventurers? Do they have packs? Uh, the tiefling is in plate. Okay. The Luxodon is in a large studded leather. Okay. For the chicken plate, is it salvageable? And will it fit Kara? Kara, what is your strength score? No, your nine. Score? Nine. Nine? Nine? You can't wear a plate. Fuck. She be dragging it. Okay. The sword, long sword? It is a long sword, yes. Take that bitch. Can you? Okay. Can Swat carry the long sword? Yes, yes, I can. She can now. Or he can now. He can now. Because he took um, Way of the Kenzai, which oh, okay. means I am proficient in weapons, specifically oh, a long sword. Let's take a minute for those playing at home. So we're all level three now, for those paying attention. Spot. So Spot is now Way of the Kenzai. And I took long sword and long bow. Long sword and long bow. Morpheus is Order of the Lycan. Okay. Eleanor is Oath of... And you three, we already knew. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, that, oh, the pact. Yeah, I don't know what pact you took. Pact of the Tome. Nice. Yeah, baby. Oh, I'm sorry. Oath of devotion. Oath of devotion. We already devotion is good. 
Shadow Sorcerer. And we already knew you were Grey Pine. Thank you. You didn't say anybody's names. You just said you, you, and oh. you. <coughs> Lorelai, yeah, mm-hmm. Lilith, Kara, in order. And they, they know who I'm talking about. <laughs> Nobody has any idea who you're pointing at right now. And Laura and I sound identical. <laughs> well, that is very true to that. But they know you're the monk, so the other one's got to be the other thing. I'm on. <laughs> All right, so back in. You're taking... Okay. Anyway, so Spot takes out the, the sword and is like, Sweet! but definitely turns around to the rest of my group and goes, um, I have an instinct that this hallway will never end and eventually we can be like these people and kill ourselves because it'll never end. Um, Because they could not get out of this. They couldn't get out once they're in? I have a feeling these two over here, Uh the elephant and the the horns... Uh that eventually they gave up and killed themselves. I don't know if it was because they went mad or because they could not escape from this never-ending hallway. Okay. We are 60 feet in right now? Yes. You're in the midway point. Can I message Morpheus? You certainly try. I would like to message Morpheus and okay. say, don't enter, but can you open the door? You hear nothing. Damn it. Too far away. No, <laughs> I'm only 60 feet in. You don't know that. Oh, with the uh, magicness. Oh, with magicness. more than 120 <laughs> I wasn't talking about you. <laughs> the magicness. Yes. So if we turn around and walk back, what are we doing? You try. All right. I'm going to turn around and start walking back. Back the way you came in? Yeah. Okay, you go 10, yeah. 15, 20 feet. Uh-huh. It's not getting any closer. Any wow. Ooh, we're like in the okay. twilight zone. How about you walk that way as far as you can, and I'm going to walk this way as far as I can. And we'll see how far we can get. Okay? Message me every couple seconds and see if we can still hear each other. And I am going to run with my feline agility as fast as I can to the left. So that would take you, what, 60 feet? Feline agility takes me like 80. 80? Okay. You move your feline 80, the far door does not get any closer. Okay. You move your speed, you don't get any closer. And you can keep messaging her the entire time. And you are... are 80, 30, you're 110 feet apart now, right right on the cusp of message range. Uh-huh. Neither door is getting closer. But can I still see her like as if she's close to me? No. She looks... You appear far away, but you're not getting any closer. Really? Uh... Neither one of you is closer to the doors. We don't know what the hell's going on. No, no. you and I are just like <laughs> chilling. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to stop, take a breath, turn around, and run back. Okay. You make so where way, Eleanor is. You make your way back to Kara and Eleanor. This sucks. Anybody see any buttons or... I'm mm-hmm. using my dark vision right now. Mm-hmm. It's dark in there. Yeah. Can we check the walls to see if anything moves? Sure. Make an like investigation check. Uh, maybe light something up with your Kendra. 13. You're not feeling any switches or You know, or like a moving wall you're not or feeling, sliding door. You know, sliding. You're not feeling anything. Nothing sliding, nothing's moving, no depressions. Can can I assist her in that, or can I run my own check? You can run your own. Okay. Investigation, is that what it would be? Mm -hmm. Yes. Seven. Nothing. I'm very happy with my sword, though. How are Morpheus and Lorelai doing through all this? I'm kind of side-eyeing Morpheus. He's a dude, and I don't like him. Um. I sense weird things, but I'm... Trying to get myself acclimated to the area, I'm not familiar with anything. And as she's, so. as she would be side eyeing Morpheus, she's like, "Do you? We haven't really heard from them. She, do you think we should like yell?" <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I think that'd probably be a good way to go. All right. So, Lorelai. You have a kind special just, ability? <laughs> no, my special ability is bitch. So she kind of just goes, Hey, guys, are you okay? You hear nothing. Wow. No response, Lorelai. So I walked that way, but I don't see the door open. I don't see anything You, t- you turned and went, back, and went back the way you came. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nothing. Um, we'll use my divine sense. Anything? Yeah. Wiki wiki that I yes. should know about? Nope. 
to nothing. Nothing hits. Stay, right? Nothing hits. I am going to. Uh, right. You could take care of Kristen's thing, but I'm gonna try to climb the walls and see if I can find anything like on the ceiling. Okay. Make an acrobatics check. Nope, I have a climb speed. Okay, never mind. Um, Make your climb speed. Do we still see the door? Yeah, you guys are right outside the door. You still see that misshapen, cockeyed door. Can I eldritch blast into the door? Sure. You don't have to roll for it. It's a fucking right. door. <laughs> door shakes a little. It just shakes? Yep. Okay. And I don't hear any screams? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't really think that worked. No. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm going to cast light on, I guess, my wand or whatever. Okay. And um, just try to inspect the walls or where I'm standing. Okay. Like, make, it a, make an investigation check. You're climbing up on the thing and doing what? Investigating with a negative one. Okay. Not 20. 19. Okay. You climb up, and it's sort of a... It's a little higher up than you had anticipated, and when you're up there, looking down at it, the tunnel only appears to be like 30 feet wide. 30 feet long. Okay. You can, like, follow the wall down one side, follow the wall down the other side. Okay. Looking down at it. It's a weird effect. Okay. Literally all I have, there's no buttons up here? No buttons. What do I see when I look at it? The walls? You're just seeing rock, yeah, stone, just, little yeah, remnants nothing of silver. Looks funny. Nothing yeah. that looks funny. While I'm up here, is there a way to, like, continue to climb any farther up? No, you're up at the... It's a slight dome to the top of it, and you're at the top of it. Okay. I will climb back down, and I'll say, guys... I think this is all an illusion. I think that it's really only 30 feet back to front. I think we have to somehow break the wall. Like, bust open the wall. Break down the wall. Because I don't see any other way we're getting out of here. And I think if there is no beginning and there is no end, we gotta go out sideways. Outside. Go down. Or down. There's a trap the wall. I mean, it is mine, right? What? If I'm able to dig, like, blow to a tunnel next to it or underneath it. Yeah, I think that's what we need to do. We need to, we need to stop thinking back and front. We need to start thinking side, up, and down. Okay. So, heads or tails? <laughs> up or down? Which way do we want to try first? Mm, I'm not there. Yeah, I, think, we're not, I think to yeah, the we're side. Not I almost think to the side myself. The side? Maybe there's a parallel tunnel. Like we it's all not blast at... one new place, right? Right. Like we all go at one specific spot. Yeah, like maybe like Eleanor weakens it, and like yeah. I'll try to pry it, and then you can like blast it or right. something. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll I'll walk back towards you guys. Yes. So Lorelai is out with Morpheus, and she kind of like looks at him. Um. It, it it's been a while. Yeah, I was about to ask you how long has it been? Five, ten minutes, fifteen minutes. You're getting on. Oh, you're going on ten minutes now. Okay, nothing. And they haven't really come back out to talk to us. Right. Do you think we should go in? Yeah, I think we should. I think you should definitely go in first. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Very dangerous. You go first. <laughs> I'll Not be right behind you. <laughs> And I look back at you, I think we gotta stick together. For some reason, I feel these guys are separated up in front. Okay, I got your back. All right. Go. Okay? Okay. Both walk in. You're just gonna walk you open the door, you step in, and you can see the four of them kind of gathered, maybe about 60 feet ahead of you. Oh, we can see them? As soon as you step through, oh, okay. you can see them. All right, okay. I and will. all of you see now Lorelei and Morpheus approaching. Oh no! I kind of like straddle the doorway because I'm like, like I said, I was gonna have his back, so I'm kind of like one foot in. Is it possible to have one foot in the one room, one foot in the other room? It is. Okay, so that's where I am right now. I'm not too far in front of her though. Wait, hold on! Don't come in yet. Can I walk over to her? You start walking. You don't get any closer to her. What do I see as she starts? I was gonna try to grab her hand if she could pull us through. Because you see the same illusion. If you jumping. were staying, it depends. If this is where the doorway is, if you were on this side of it, like this, you would see Morpheus walk in and disappear. Okay. If you move to look through, you'd, you'd see everybody in the hallway. So, like, I, I'm kind of doing, I'm on the east bank, I'm on the west bank kind of thing. Mm-hmm. And, like, this this isn't normal. 
<laughs> I'm just like kind of like doing this. So I don't really see. I, from this side, I don't see her. Are you stepping in and out, or are you? She's no. in between. One both. foot straddled on the east side. She's like foot straddled on the west side. In the okay. Cold war, east and if you move, if you move back and forth like that, you can see more. You see everybody. Blank hallway. Everybody. Can I see her doing this? Blank hallway. Uh, which passive? Passive. Passive. Fourteen. You do, and you see her. Laura, like, like top half, bleep, 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 uh, bleep. Lorelei step in, and when she goes like that, she oh. disappears. <laughs> see her step in, see her disappear. All right. So I'm going to tell her, wait, don't come in yet, but I can't get to her. Correct. Well, how are you approaching her? I'm trying to run over to her because I want to grab her hand Towards and for her, us to get pulled out. Towards her, so she's there. Yeah. Yep, not getting any closer. All right, listen. If you come in, you can't get out. Well, where do you want me? I don't know. What do you want to do? I'm just letting you know the situation. The situation is is a never-ending hallway. I clearly can't get to you, and I can't get to the end. We're about to blow through that wall to the side. You want to come and help us? How about I stay here while you try to blow through the wall? That's a good idea. Okay. I'll watch. I'm not the strength. I'm not the magic. You guys bust down that wall. <laughs> clearly on the brains. <laughs> just joking. No. I mean, I don't know what I have to bust down the wall. Now, where's the wall? Can Rolfius see the wall. It's just the wall. It's just the wall of the, 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 the cave. It's yes. not. You're all, the, the, uh, except for you who's straddling the hallway, one leg in, one way out. You're all in the center of this hallway now, 60 feet on either side. You can each see both ends. Yeah. That try like punching the wall. The wall that you're standing right there next to? It? Yeah, because you said we're going to try to go through the wall. Okay. Yeah, it's a brick. Well, I'm going to jog it up. Yeah. Oh, no, what I'm saying is it's brick as in like Somebody built it, yeah. so maybe it is just a wall, not a You cave. hit it. Shakes a little bit. Just shakes. Just punch the floor. Punch, huh? the, punch the floor. Punch the floor. Yeah. Or stomp or something. Okay, I'm gonna okay. punch the floor. That's what I'm doing. She hits the floor. Shaking, echoing, boom. Warping. Sounds like, a, you know, like, you hit, like you hit something. Uh, we're clearly going in the wrong direction because the DM is smiling an evil smile. I'm smiling because the answers are the answer's been given to you. You guys just haven't caught it yet. All right. Hint, hint. It has to do with something Lorelai's doing. In and out. She inadvertently stumbled on the answer. But if I can't get her, if she's half in and half out, mm-hmm. but how she's can I get forward and back? She moves in. Yeah. Well, she was. I don't know if she's still doing it. Oh, but I'm it... absolutely still doing that. Okay, then you just see a. a an infinite loop of Lorelei in, huh? Ah. And then she looks back and disappears. Looks in, disappears. Forward and back. All right. So if we all, all of us, go to toward Lorelei. Okay, all five of you mm-hmm. turn and walk towards Lorelei. Right? Yeah. She's not getting any closer. I'm done with this fucking thing. I'm getting pissed off. <laughs> Whoever's proficient can make an Arcana check. Nope. 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 19? Okay. In and out at the same time. I want to call out to Spot. We can in and out at the same time. How can Hey! We... Hey! Hey! Talking to myself. Go ahead. Try walking backwards. Huh? Walk backwards towards me. Alright. I'm going to turn my back to her. Okay. I'm going to walk backwards. You pop right next to Lorelai. Fucking shit! All of you just see Spot turn, walk backwards, and disappears. Everyone walk backwards toward Lorelei. Oh, okay. can't see you. No, but if Lorelei is still in the door, she can yeah. say that. Half, if half you half turn half. and walk backwards towards Lorelei, you would all one by one go back to the room you just came back. from. Okay, wait. If I, I know it's so easy I can get to her. I'm going to turn backward again with my back toward the group, and I'm going to walk back. Toward, uh, back into the hallway? Toward the other side. To the group. The group just exited into the room you're in. You said you're turning your back and walking away from the group. Is everybody in the room? Nobody's caught in the little... Back in the main chamber, yes. The room you just came out of, yes. Okay, so everyone's back in that chamber. Everyone's safe. At that door where we walked through and we got trapped, I'm going to back into that door now. Okay. You see Spot disappear, and Spot, you take like two steps and wind up at the other end of the hallway. Where the light rock is. Mm -hmm. Now you look down and you see the light rock, and there's another doorway out. Back up into this room, and we'll we'll be able to get through it. Mm-hmm. 
It's a wonderful trick. I'm very pissed off. All right. <laughs> Lorelai just smiles. <laughs> Thank you, Lorelai. You're welcome. Everybody, back it up. Back it up, back it up, back Correct. it up, back it up. And we see another door. And one by one, if you all turn your backs <laughs> and walk through, you would one step and then one by one, all of your part, your team members arrive with your team members. And there's a little light rock at the end of the tunnel and another door, doorway exiting out. Okay. I pick up my rock. All right, so now this is where you threw the light rock to begin with. So we're kind of like at here, and you said there's another door that leads out, right? Yeah. Hmm? I'm going to go investigate whatever door that is. Okay. 18. Okay. Looks like a normal door. Not, you don't see any traps, nothing. All right, I'm going to open the door. I'm going to turn around, and I'm going to back in. <laughs> okay. Uh, this is going to be my new maneuver you going just open forward. The door and, and back again? <laughs> yeah. Make a dexterity save. Okay. Save. Save, yeah. 13. Okay, you catch yourself as you almost fall down the stairs that are immediately on the other side of the doorway. It's a set of maybe six or seven uneven stone steps that look like they were sanded or carved out by hand uh, that go down and end on a landing. I'm going to crawl down the steps like a two-year-old learning to go up and down steps for the first time. Okay. I don't know what, you, what two-year-old you think crawls down the steps, but that seems like a bad idea. Wouldn't you fall on your head? No. Butt first. <laughs> You're sliding down your butt? No. I'm on a, a set of stairs on my four paws, backing down them, like crawling uh... down the steps. You're all watching this, too. A spot is looking at you, <laughs> but backing down um, this set of stairs. That's a sight. <laughs> when I get to the landing, I'll turn around. Okay. You get to the landing, turn around. Uh, you are at the base of a circular chamber. Ceiling is about 20 feet high, smooth, cement-like stone walls. Um, in the middle of the room is a brightly glowing gem on a plain stone pedestal, about the size of a fist. Laying next to the gem, maybe 10 feet away from it, is a humanoid skeleton that has one hand extended like it's reaching for the gem. Is anyone following Spot, or are you all letting Spot do a thing? In the room, other than the gem, what else do I see? Uh, you see another doorway, open doorway, there's no door in it, but it's like an open corridor that goes in like curves toward the, like goes in maybe five feet and then curves toward the right on the opposite side of the stone pedestal. For anything else, that that's just what you see immediately, just looking around. I yell up the stairs <laughs> and I say, it's a really, really cool, beautiful gem and a dead thing and another doorway, but this room should be clear. Oh, Okay. Lilith makes her way down, and you see the same scene. Plain stone pedestal, brightly glowing gem, about ten feet away, hands and knees, but one hand is extended. Oh. You see one, uh, like, skeleton, humanoid say skeleton, reaching for the gem. Does the skeleton have anything on it? Clothes? Weapons? Um, make an investigation or perception check. I'll allow either. Seventeen. Seventeen? Uh, looks like it was uh, just in plain robes, and it's very dusty and like frayed and the, 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 the material itself is decaying so it's hard to see how ornate it was but just plain robes or tunic. I'm going to step behind the skeleton. Can I do that? Yeah. Bend down so that my eyes are at his level and try to see what he was looking at. Is the it the stone? The gem. Okay. I want to use my mage hand to take it. Okay. You activate your mage hand and your mage hand passes through it. It's like the gem's not really there. Oh, there is no gem. Interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, with that, Lilith, make a perception check. Thirteen. You see on the ceiling, there are dozens of tiny holes. Ooh. Tiny holes? Holes. Like holes, how, like how tiny? Like I could get shot with a dart? Holes, Maybe, or... would that be half inch diameter, inch diameter? Yeah. Um, spot, have you ever seen that before? And I like look up. You see it now, it's your spot. How far up is the ceiling? And is there, a, is there a wall that's near it? The whole circular chamber of walls going up, and it's a 20 foot, it's a ceiling 20 feet high. Can I walk up the wall and get a better look up? Yes, you can do that with your climbing speed. Okay, I'm going to climb up the wall, and I'm going to kind of like reach over and look at them. Okay, you take a look in one of the holes, Yeah. and you can see, you think that's a metal spike. 
Uh, it's like chambered inside the hole. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna take my new sword. And I'm gonna put my sword like if this is the little spike that's coming out. I want to go like this with my sword underneath it. Okay, nothing happens. But does the gem underneath flicker? <laughs> so this isn't casting an image of a gem. No, 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 no. no. Okay. You know, for an abandoned mine, this place is kind of like freaky. Yeah, it is. Yeah, like what are they protecting in here? Then with my nail, with my nails, I'm gonna try to pick at the top of the little thingy. It's a spike. It's a metal spike. I thought it was a hole. With a spike inside of it, so chambered inside of it. So the ceiling's full of these holes. <gasps> yeah. Oh, don't touch the gem or the freaking spikes will attack you. All right, okay. so. Gonna, All right, I I'm climbed down. message Morpheus and say, you can bring everybody down now. Go through, Morpheus, you hear it. Yeah. You hear Lilith's voice in your head. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go forward. The only other way out is through that corridor that kind of curves to the right. Okay. I will go to that corridor, and I will stealth through. Okay. Roll stealth check. Over 20. That turns into a long corridor, which looks like... A, it, it's the most mine-looking thing you've seen yet. It's very soil, a lot of soil, rock, various uh, veins that have been mined out. You can tell that's where the silver was that has now been carved out of the wall and out of the ceiling. The ceiling is braced with, like, rotted-out wooden beams... Uh, and the floor is strewn with various rubble and rusted out picks and shovels. This looks like an abandoned mining vein. And there's these little small alcoves every five feet or so on either side that look like workstations where miners would be actually working, pulling the silver out of the... Spot's the only one that sees this. Spot went in stealth in first, and you all just saw Spotlight kind of go around the So we're still in this room. I'm going to take out my slingshot, I'm going to take out a rock, and I'm going to just fling it down the hall. Okay. Not again. And I'm going to listen to hear if I hear any groan or mumble or rumble. No. All right, after a minute, I'll peek back in the other room and be like, okay, this is like a mining shaft, it's okay. Okay. And then I'll keep walking. Okay. You all follow, I am assuming? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I would like everyone's passive perception scores, please. 10. 11. 13. 14. 12. Okay. Spot, you said 14, right? Yeah. So Spot and Kara. Your party is moving down the hallway, and they're all just fairly like, okay, cool, we're in a mine now. But the two of you catch. Spot, you're in the lead, right? Yeah. And a carrier toward the back, I think. Mm -hmm. But each of you kind of catch, when you reach the halfway point, you hear a bit of scurrying coming from the left side. And when you turn and look, you see one of the alcoves is lined with spider webs. And up from the bottom, you begin to see spider claws. So we did. Large size. And this is to the left side? To the left side. And I'm out front? Am I the only one who sees it right now? You two notice it. I yell out, to the left, and I turn and I point my sword. <laughs> that spot does its best General Napoleon pose. <laughs> <laughs> this was his best Napoleon. Okay. And point, and you all notice this large spider claws making its way up out of that alcove. Okay. Just to be clear, it's just one thing we see emerging? That's all you're seeing uh, when, she, when, he, when he points it out. That's all you're seeing is the one. How far, how far is it from us? Oh, if you're in the whole middle, it's like ten feet. I'm actually gonna pause there. We'll we'll we'll, we'll do the we'll do initiative in the next in the, okay. the next chapter. Okay.